Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Amber here with a farming guide for leather. We're starting at Edmund's Hope High Point in East Anglia and just to the west, to Eivor's left, you will see there's an opal there that I've marked, but that is actually near a cave where there's lots of brown bears that spawn. So I'm going to send my raven over there to mark them for you. And each of these brown bears is gonna have about 45 leather. And there's often a fifth bear in the vicinity. So in this small area, you can get over 200 leather. There's one, two, three, and four bears. Although you can only mark three at a time. And if you mark a fourth, the first one you marked will disappear. So this again is in the East Anglia region. Suggested power is 55. So this is a pretty low power area. So this farm should be accessible no matter your power level. However, I'm going to be pretty bold and just rush in and try to kill all these bears at once. If you're lower power, you're probably not going to want to do it like this. You're maybe going to want to isolate one bear at a time or use your bow to take them down from a distance. But I'm just going to go all in <laughs> because this is a max power character. Eivor is level power 400 here. So there's, although I do get hit, a few times I'm not in danger of being killed so that's why I'm just going all in using the throwing axe fury ability so if you have that I recommend it against multiple targets I'm also using the brigandine armor which gives me additional perks when surrounded by multiple enemies so if you have it recommend that the other reason that I'm going all in on melee here is because I also have the auto loot skill that's in the raven skill tree which means when I kill an enemy via melee I'm going to automatically loot them and so here I'm going to automatically get the leather you see I'm getting 48 leather plus the brown bear fur whereas if I kill them with my bow I have to chase them to loot them for the leather and then here is the other bear, which I'm going to use Dive of the Valkyries ability. And both Dive of the Valkyries and Throwing Axe Fury are pretty early game abilities. I have a whole guide to early game melee abilities. I'll link that in the description. I'll also link my other farming guides for ingots, tungsten, nickel, and carbon. So make sure you check out the description for a link to my playlist with all my Assassin's Creed videos. So there's often a fifth bear, there it is. There's often a fifth bear nearby, as well as a patrol carrying nickel. Oh, and there it is. And actually, it looks like they're fighting the bear. Huh, yeah, so the bear is attacking this patrol. So I'm also gonna get an additional batch of leather from this bear, as well as a nickel ingot from this patrol. So this is a really great spot to farm leather, and if you're lucky, there's also a patrol carrying nickel nearby. So since I used my throwing axe fury ability, I did not auto loot these guards, so I have to do it. I didn't mean to pick him up, I meant to throw that weapon using the battlefield bolt ability. But let me just loot these to get the nickel. And there it is, nickel ingot. And so let me fast travel out of the area to re- Oh, let me kill this guy first. Oh, I'm out of arrows. <laughs> Oops. That's the other reason I often just use melee because I find myself running out of arrows pretty frequently in this game. So great. Now you don't have to kill all these enemies, but I just do it to get out of combat so I can fast travel out of the area because that's how I find you can reset the spawn for the bears is to fast travel 
out of the region. So once I'm out of combat here, I'm going to travel out of East Anglia to a different high point. This is where I'm at right now, just west of the Edmunds Hope high point in East Anglia, where I got the leather. And now I'm just going to go to a different high point. This is Black Peak in Granobridgeshire, which is also a good place to farm for carbon ingots. But right now I'm just going here to get out of the area. Oh, but there's also usually arrows here. So let me grab those since I need arrows. Okay. Now, before returning, I'm going to save and reload my game. So to reset the spawn, I recommend fast traveling out of the area, saving your game, and then reloading the save you just made. And that seems to make the bears come back. <laughs> so that's why even though there's only a few bears, they respawn every time. So you can just, oh, and it's raining, which is good. Since the weather changed, it means that it did reset. So the bears should still be here, but I will use my raven to find them before I end the video, just to show you that the four bears did respawn in East Anglia near Edmund's Hope. So let me, I just set that waypoint to remind me where to look. And then gonna send out my raven Show me. to check for the bears. And I actually found this place because I was looking to get that opal. So I was going over here to this cave to get the opal. And then all of a sudden four bears attacked me. And I was like, oh, this would be a good place to farm for leather. And there's one bear, two, three, and four. So the bears did respond. Let's see if I can, oh, there's the fifth one. There's the fifth bear. Ah, and there's the patrol carrying nickel. Wow. Okay. So... Now I can, again, get five bears plus a nickel ingot in this same location. So this shows they respawn. This is Amber. Subscribe to my channel for more tips and tricks like this for Assassin's Creed Valhalla that you won't find any place else. Thanks for watching all the way to the end and see you in the next one.